another vlog here at Adventure Time. Today we are at the Fort Park Resort to experience Oktoberfest. We've got lots of updates on. So we've got fine nights, construction, we've got the new borders around um, Exodus. Exodus. Let's go! Let's go! So in what could be literally a few weeks, maybe a month away, that direction is where Exodus will be going skyward very very soon we are led to believe. So we're coming into the um the shop in the dome, but the tills have gone from this end. Interesting. There's not a lot for Oktoberfest this year. The pin is last year's. I feel like that's last year's as well. I feel like all of this is last year's to be fair. Just a quick look at the prices up there. Yep, 2022. Last year's pin. Let me just get our first look at the new uh, maze here at Thor Park called Stitches. Oh, that looks so good. That does look really good. Dolls house. Oh. I just hope that the rest of it is steam because at the minute it's just a marquee. It looks like it's going to be a big old maze. Mm, it's supposed to be the biggest one here at Thorpe Park, apparently. So. Can't wait. Can't wait. Got some marquees down here for the crows. That's it. Walking I can never Meadows. remember. Walking Meadows. Walking Meadows. I can never remember it, but yeah. So, how many marquees have we got, Hayley? We've got one, one two, three. At least five. At least five. Yeah. It will obviously be a lot different layout to what it was last year, that's for sure. So, obviously, we had saw the uh, maze that was there with the boat. The boat's gone now, so. It looks like it's getting bigger and better every year mm. and the crows are always a great one. Definitely. It's tame, but scary at the same time. Ooh. Here's a better look without the fence in the way this time. Go. Here's the entrance to Morkin Meadow. You see, they're still setting up, still getting the hay bales out. Yeah, not too much to see, unfortunately, just yet. It's got about two weeks to go. Two weeks to go. So, as we've just pan around from Old Town, what was Old Town? We have. Exodus with the pier holes and they've got a great big uh, drill. Yeah. Something like that. But yeah, you've got now pier holes. So look, you can take a glimpse into what's going on here at Exodus. Oh wow, you get a really, really good view of the whole the whole stuff, what they're doing. So I think right in front of us, you can see here, I think this is where the station building might be going. And obviously the lift hill going sort of up that way. See you next time. We reckon we're literally a week, two weeks away before it starts going vertical. It can't be long. It really can't be long. Yeah, how how that has changed. Obviously you had Logger's Leap over there. We came in April time yep. to see Logger's Leap. Now we have to go and swarm to look at all the footage and stuff yes. while we're here. Yes, because it's and, supposed uh, to be quite a few. Yes. Let's go. Oh, I'm excited. Just take you around the hall. And obviously all around here used to be advertisement for the events coming up. So so yeah. Colossus is 98 foot. Two, three, six. That oh, is quite a jump, isn't it? Just a little bit. Obviously we have done a coaster already, but it's three feet taller than that. As you will see in the upcoming videos, this will probably be out before our Europa Park vlog. But yes. Yeah, but Thorpe and Europa don't even compare. Well, that's not going to that. But yes, Thorpe Park 2024. Don't miss <laughs> the UK's tallest and fastest roller coaster. Oh, it gives me goose pimples just thinking about it. 
So the sign for trailers and break our bozos is still out, but the posters have now been taken down. Getting ready yeah, for uh, we've got the other one starting to reappear down there. Oh have we? Let's have a yeah, quick $8 Oh yeah. And I can't read what that says. Oh nightmare uh I can't read what that says. Sequel. But yeah. So yeah, new posters will be going in and obviously the sign will be changed very soon. Here we go, it's our first glimpse of Oktoberfest. Looks busy, but where's the stage? It doesn't look very good this year. No, it definitely doesn't look very good. Here we go, it's the first glimpse of the stage. Very not to experience our Oktoberfest having a brat hearst. Nine quid for a brat hearst. Not too bad. Don't think you get your Merlin discount though, unfortunately. So I just got a brat hearst with a pint. And I must admit, the Camden Junction, you do get your Merlin discount to get 20% off beer, which isn't too bad. How's your brat hearst, Ailey? <laughs> Yummy. Yummy. Good. Does look good. I can't wait for this ride. So good. What are you thinking about Oktoberfest so far then, Ailey? I'm a little bit disappointed. I don't think it's as good as other years. No. It I... hasn't got that vibe. It's only in one area, isn't it? Around by um, the ghost train and that's it. There's no other... Yeah, that's the only thing we've got. Like, you've got a whole park. Use it. They did last year. I mean, we had flags. We had BB around. This year, I think it's just in one area. It's disappointing, but kind of us where we are just coming out to sell. It's one of the fine nights nice updates. So just in front of stealth here, they seem to have put up, well, it looks like a stage with a minibus in front of it. So, what could this be for, Hayley? Um, Nike Sports and um, Amity, which he is in this year. Well, it's not that, is it? It's something else this year, I think. It's, um, no, it's still them, but it's uh, together rather oh, than okay. separate again. Yeah. So, yeah. So, we haven't really got any updates for survival games other than obviously it's coming back and all the theming is still there. Just literally just round the corner. But yeah, I think our plan is if the queue isn't too long, we might just go on and do the swarm and have a look and see how many supports there is for Exodus. Yes. We shall have a look. No one knows or is willing to comment on what has caused this chaos. Oh boy, it's busy today here at Thor Park. We believe that these yellow signs there's actually been a uh, fun run on today so yeah it's very very busy here at Hill Park so we're going to end our vlog here thank you all for watching um Oktoberfest slight disappointment really I think yeah it's, it's a shame because it should have like that upbeat atmosphere the yeah. fun kind of end of summer vibes and it just doesn't no it doesn't doesn't come I to I don't it. know if it's because we came on the same day as the park run don't know maybe they've changed it a little bit I don't know but I mean, it's they're, they're definitely concentrating more on uh, uh, Fright Nights you can tell yes. that Fright Nights they're but getting Fright prepared Nights for Fright Nights is always there yeah year. definitely so do you want to go I'm concerned, nothing else matters it's Fright Nights if you want to go to a proper Oktoberfest or a better Oktoberfest Go to Alton Towers, they seem to be putting yes, more effort into it. Yeah, a lot better. But yeah, but yeah, we managed to uh, show you some of the construction updates from uh, Friday nights as well as a bit of Exodus updates as well, which is good to see. Can't wait for that to start to go vertical. And with in the next week or two. Yes, and with that, we'll leave it there. Hit that like button, like button, hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you on the next adventure. Bye.